Hard to believe it's real. Imagine what it took to make this. The craftsmen, the engineers. Yeah. Their work still stands. Ah! But they're gone. Maybe their king should have used their wealth to protect his people and not make such an inviting target. Okay, ready? You first. Your way up. There, look, you can see some structures beneath the falls. You know what? Apologies. This way. You sure it's safe? You know, you keep asking me that. It'll save us both some time if you just assume it's not. Oh, 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 oh boy. It's definitely not safe, by the way. I saw. Think you can get back up here? Yeah. Keep going. I'll catch up. <laughs> Oh, 
definitely not safe, by the way. I saw. Think you can get back up here? Yeah. Keep going. I'll catch up. Only because you said, please. I didn't, actually. What you said Ganesh was the removal of obstacles. He's more than happy to place them in your way if he thinks you'll benefit. That why the horse and I'll chase him for do. He's also the lord of good fortune, the one you pray to for prosperity and success. Got it. That's cool. Is this really the only way across? Yep. <laughs> You having fun out there? You know it. Fraser! Fraser! Really the only way across. Yep. You having fun out there? Doing great, China. Thanks. I'll be doing better when we get to the crown. Surprised we haven't seen the Saab yet. Knock on wood. Oh, he's around. Doubt we'll see him up here. Why is that? He doesn't have the stones to climb this high. <laughs> I think I see a place we can swing over to the crown. Just a little farther to go. Huh? Oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh. Oh, thank you. Hurry up and climb. I'm slipping. Worth it. Impressive. Yeah. Oh. Now, how do we get off this thing? Okay. Easy does it. All right. 
right. Well, here's more sturdy up here. Don't jinx us. <laughs> It's our way in, courtesy of the Persian army. <sighs> wow. Nice shot. The Persians must have had a trebuchet. Trebuchet? Can't you just say catapult like a normal person? A trebuchet is a type of catapult. It can handle heavier projectiles, like this one, and fling them longer distances. Right. You learned that in your military training? I looked it up on Wikipedia, like a normal person. Ready? Do you? Yeah. Oh, shit, Fraser! Ready? After you. Incredible. It's our old friends. Hara Sharama and Ganesh. Really? Looks like they're fighting. Well, when the Hindu gods aren't off fighting demons, they're sometimes fighting each other. But well, it's not a fair fight. Ganesh isn't even armed. I guess it's not really his style. This whole place out of the mountain? Sure looks like it. They barricaded the door. They didn't do them much good. Guess they didn't expect the Persians to drop in from above. You'd think after two prior invasions they'd be prepared for anything. Or they just never thought they'd be defeated. Through here. Hey, look, armaments. You're right, Nadine. I have no women. Is this all Persian? Ah, uh, looks to be a mix of Persian and Hoysala. Now we're getting somewhere. Hey, another one of these doors. Now let's see. <laughs> Some light. There's like a crypt in here. Crypts and burials aren't really a Hindu thing. They generally favor cremation. It's a beautiful ceremony, Antiyishti, Sanskrit for last sacrifice. Sacrifice? The idea is our bodies are merely borrowed vehicles and you're returning it so that others might benefit. It's a lovely sentiment. Too late for these poor bastards. Hey, up here. <laughs> What the 
hell. Jesus. This was it. Their final stand. Well, wasn't enough to save their empire. But their loss is our gain. Here's our way in. Nadine, can you lend a hand with this chap? Sure. Come on, old fella. There we go. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. We must be getting close. Hopefully closer than these guys. Well, this device looks familiar. <laughs> oh. Well, that's different. What is all this? If I had a guess, I'd say it's some kind of lock mechanism to open that door. Okay, on the left, we have Shiva gifting Parashurama the axe, and on the right, we have Parashurama chopping off Ganesha's tusk. Wait, with the axe? Yeah. The one that Shiva, Ganesha's father, gave to Parashurama? Yeah. <laughs> it's messed up. That's family. <laughs> Come on, let's see about opening that door. So how does all this work? Uh, only one way to find out. Let's see what this does. All right, that slid the piece away from me. It's shadow move too. Let's try this. Over you go. See what's happening. The shadows need to move. Right, so let's see if I can line them all up. This actually looks like fun. Nowhere for them to go. That's not going to do anything. Salah and the tiger. Here we go. Fingers crossed. That's supposed to happen? I don't know. Just don't get us killed. You're no fun. Ready? Oh. Careful. Mm. Amazing. What the Shiva? Mm, my thoughts exactly. Razor? Ross? Oh no. No, it's okay. I think we're gonna be okay. Okay? Where the hell's the tusk? I don't know. None of this makes any sense. Yeah, it does. 
The Hoysala sent us on a fool's errand. I think you're right. Terrific. No, hear me out. Ganesh is the symbol of... Halabadu. And Shiva was the symbol of... Belor. Which was the old... The old capital. Exactly. What if the king built this spectacular city, and it was a wonderful target for the Persians? And the old capital was forgotten. So this whole city was a decoy. What if they let it get plundered? Protect Balor. And their treasure. I'm willing to bet the tusk was never here at all. So where's Balor? Oh shit. This is definitely not supposed to happen. It's coming loose. Oh. Grab the edge, quick! I'm wrong, but wasn't there a huge waterfall here? There was. What the hell is that? Aqueducts. <clears throat> the water's channeling there from the falls. Amazing. Did we do this just now? Well. Technically, I did. Cocky. <laughs> Look, uh, sorry if I cut too close to the bone back there. Oh. That's all right. You know, you two would have got on like a house on fire. He was also a really stubborn dickhead. <laughs> You know, none of this could have possibly gone unnoticed. We should probably get out of here. Good point. Follow me. Right. Oh. The water is being channeled toward the gate, so let's follow the aqueduct. Copy that. <laughs> I'll take point. They flooded their city to protect their secrets. You think the soldiers knew they were being used as decoys? Honesty is not always the best policy. Look it from that old man in the city. Dumb bastard. Didn't give it up easily. Right. You take left, yeah, I take I right. Remember. What the? That works too. Nice job. Probably more where that came from. Right. 
Right, uh, sorted. being left to rot in the cell to getting tortured. Duly noted. Now, how the hell do we get out? Look up. Ha! Ha! Right, 
you are. Here Up here, there's a breach. <laughs> Shiva. It's impressive. My man worked for a week and turned up nothing. They probably hired the wrong expert. Perhaps. You know. A Hoysala poet once wrote of a young king who showed mercy and thus ended our rituals. But the old kings, they understood that progress demands sacrifice. <laughs> Is that what you tell your men? Times of war, these aqueducts, they would run red through the capital. Those who would not fight had to be used to inspire those who would. Come on. This will be over soon. See, to rule a people, you must first sow chaos. I will incite my civil war, stamp out the weak bloodline of the young king, starting with you. Okay. You okay? Yeah. I think so. Hey, take it easy. You've been out for almost half an hour. Half an hour? Yeah. Oh, shit. <sighs> shit, the Sarv's got the disc. Just hang on. Oh, we gotta get going. Hey, <sighs> relax, all right? Think you can manage? Yeah, I've had worse nights, believe me. <laughs> I won't ask. <laughs> it's good to have you back. There's... There's two of you now, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's go and get our disc. And some guns. And some guns. <sighs> uh... Can I just say, you were not joking about Asav. I mean, wow, he looks so unassuming. Right? That's exactly what he wants. Pretty sure his glasses are an affectation. To make him look harmless or smart? Both. <laughs> but he is smart. 
was a doctor before he took up his course. So he left behind a lucrative career. I'm sure at one point he thought it was the right thing to do. Hi. You sure you're good to go? As good as I'll ever be. Just need to take it easy for a bit. Up here. Go slow. The gate. We made it. Let's get that thing open. Shiva's gatekeeper. That's got to be the entrance to the old capital. It had to be triggered by the aqueducts. Yep. Oh, shit. Asov's already heading inside. Okay, well, better get down there. Come on. No. What do you mean, no? Same Drake. He's a goddamn expert. It's same Drake. Yeah. Peace. You know what? This is a good thing. I can kill two birds with one stone. Nadine. What? What? Sam's kind of the reason why we're here in the first place.